Alright, so this is going to be a video on weighing, and in particular we're going to be weighing some solid, some sodium chloride, or a table salt. Because this container is so large, um, we in general want to not double scoop from the, the stock container, so we're going to use the scoopula and put some of this sodium chloride into another container that we can repeatedly scoop from without risk of kind of contaminating or making bad the original stock. So we're just pouring out an arbitrary amount of table salt into the speaker, like that. Once we're done with the stock container, we'll just cap it back up and put it aside and put it away later. And now to actually weigh the sodium chloride substance, we can use two different types of weighing material. We can use a weigh paper and crease it along both diagonals to create some sort of weigh boat. Or we can use an actual weigh boat, um, which has sides to prevent the material from falling out of. And now moving on to the actual weighing machine, we'll turn it on, wait for it to start up, and you'll see that it should read zero grams. Um, we're going to put our weigh boat on there with nothing in it, wait for the reading to stabilize, and it, it won't always stay at a single number, but this looks like it's pretty stable, so we'll tear it. And what tearing does is subtracts the weight of the weigh boat so that we're only measuring the material itself. And so once that's done, we can reopen up one of these doors. And do make sure the door is closed when you're doing the weighing. It will affect the measurement. Just breaking up some of the salt pieces. And then and then we're going to just put an arbitrary amount of salt into our weigh boat, making sure not to spill any outside of the weigh boat. And then we're going to close up the machine, wait for our measurement to stabilize, which it looks like we do, we, it has. Um, so we have about one gram of an ACL. And once you're done weighing, you can just remove your weigh boat and use or dispose of the solid, whichever you want to do, and then just tear it again for use for another measurement.